Wow, this is a bad look for the Detroit Lions, so let's talk about it. Yo, what is going on everybody? So welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. So in today's video, I'll be talking about Calvin Johnson is willing to end the beef with the Detroit Lions if they pay him the $1.6 million. So before we get started in today's video, if you are new to the channel, you'll make sure you hit that like button to help me rank on my YouTube and for the algor algorithm to help push out my new videos. Also, hit the subscribe button with the notification bell on so you guys will be instantly notified when I upload a new video or multiple videos or a couple of gaming streams. Also, get in the comment section down below. You'll let me know what you guys think about the uh, this little beef between Calvin Johnson and the Detroit Lions. Uh, also, a uh, huge shout out to the people at Spotlight Sports Network for partnering with me. I uh, can't wait to do more, a lot of things with you guys in the future. Also, if anyone is interested in getting Philly Sports Podcast merch, my Teespring store link will be down below in the description. Also, you can follow my podcast series, Sports Talk Podcast, every Sunday at 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'll put the playlist link down below. But tonight, I'll be going live at 8.30 tonight, so I can't, can't wait to see you guys there. Uh, also, you can follow me on tw uh, Twitter, at Philly Podcast YT. You can also follow me on Instagram, at Philly Sports 97. You can also follow me on TikTok, at Philly Sports 97. And you can finally follow me on Twitch, at twitch.tv uh, slash Philly Sports Podcast. Um, link, all of those links will, will be down below in the description. So with that being said, let's jump right into it. So obviously, after Calvin Johnson retired, the Detroit Lions unfortunately had to force him pay, may, just basically told him, said, look, you had to pay pay the $1.6 million of your signing bonus back to them. And it's like, you would think, uh, you know, it sounds fucked up. And it does. Like, like you told one of your, probably, one of your greatest wide receivers you had it in, your fran in your franchise history. Might be wrong on that, but you would think, you would think Calvin Johnson would. I mean, the Detroit Lions would have had a better solution than that. Than that, I don't think they did. But I just feel like now. Uh, I mean, obviously, you know, five almost five years later since the last time he pl Calvin Johnson played, he's willing to end the like I like I said in the, in the title in the title. He is willing to end the beef unless the uh, Detroit Lions, you know, kind of pay back pay him back the one point six million that they forced him to, to repay back. Um, obviously, and this is what I think about too, but and th this also goes with the Detroit Lions. Him and, and you know, him and Matthew Stafford pretty much kept that franchise and you know as relevant as much as possible. Now, not so much anymore because yeah, your quarterback because Matthew Stafford was probably a good quarterback for them. Unfortunately, they ran him out of town. They Calvin Johnson probably one of their greatest wide receivers. He's one of their greatest wide receivers that, that they take in uh, in their franchise history. Um, he retired in 2016 and just pretty much just basically you, you guys made basically Detroit the, the Detroit Lions made him lose the love of the, for the love of the game basically I I don't know what I don't know why the the Detroit Lions is this is just like a, a shambles of an organization that you had two of your better players that you, that kept you relevant for a handful of years and then you probably and then you drove drove them out out you drove. Matthew Stafford out to L.A. to the Rams, and now you had, you know, you had, you basically you made your wide receiver retire in 2016. But what do you guys think about this? You know, do you think he should? I mean, do you think the Detroit Lions, the, the Detroit Lions should repay the 1.6 million back to Calvin Johnson so he can end this petty beef? But what do you? But let me know what you think in the comments down below. But this is Rob from the Philly Sports Podcast. I'll see you guys in the next.